Hi guys, Brian the Squirrel, I am back with another video. Today, I am going to be letting Sophie put makeup on my face. Wait, 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 wait. Brian, you can't have makeup with beard. It won't work. It's time to shave. So we're not, we're not doing, we're not doing this. Okay, well, um, Mr. Grumpy Pants uh, can't explain, so I will. What's gonna happen is I'm gonna do this beautiful face full of beautiful makeup without his beard. While I'm doing it, we thought we'd be sick and twisted to uh, ask questions you would, well, I don't think we would ask them, but ask the Rex. I think we're mad doing this. I'm going to be near your eyes. She, she's gonna be near my eyes with little stick. And big sticks. And big sticks. While well, asking questions that could possibly piss her the hell off, I may lose an eye. What's this? No matter what happens in this video. Honesty. Honesty and no killing. We're not allowed to fall out. We'll still be best friends after this. Mm, <laughs> Maybe not, not best be friends. Four boards, but yeah. What are you putting on my face first? I'm gonna use mine because. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's the first question? Where one thing you hate the most about the other person? What do I hate most? Oh, so there's more. There, there is a few. Well, we said honesty. Yeah. But well, the things I hate about you are probably the things that you hate about yourself. Thing that I hate the most is probably backhandedness. You know how to give a compliment but fully make it sound like it's a terrible insult. Oh yeah, I remember them. They were the best times. They were the best times? You still do it. Ow. You've got a weird head. Yes, I know I've got a weird head. It's egg shaped. It's beautiful, it's like a Mr. Potato Head. Mm. That's what it's like, the I'm not a fucking Mr. Potato Head. Right, come um, on, your answer. The way you've got a way of like pretending you're listening when we both know you're not. <laughs> so you could be looking at me and nodding and you, I could ask you and you, you would know the answer only because you kind of know what I'm saying, but not because you've been listening, if that makes sense. Yeah. Do not open your eyes. Well, you've got something on my eyes, I don't think I'm going to be opening them while it's um, on. Um, best memory of the other person. Uh, I'll go first. Go well, we've been out, we were in a bit of a state, obviously. We was walking home, it had no shoes on. We decided to do the tango down the street. Even going, do, do, do. We didn't care, and then you tried. You tried doing the drop. Um, do you know when you drop with the tent that like... Oh, right, yeah. And it didn't work, so that's mine. My best memory of you. It's a weird one. It's after we broke up for the first time. First big breakup. Not one of the small ones. Yeah. This makes me sad. <laughs> we went on a date. Oh yeah. We spent a lot. He knows how to treat a woman. But you, anyone who wants, you know. But it's not even the parts where I spent a lot that were. I, I'll even. I even think you'll agree. Uh, they weren't the best parts. The best parts. Well, what were, do you like him spending money on? <laughs> but the best parts were literally we went to get breakfast, full English each, because if you. Go on a date and get salad. I will not respect you. Unless you're vegan or something like that and you want me. to the door and then I don't respect you. <laughs> be hooker or classy? Classy? Right. I'm a classy bro. Literally the best part of that day was when I got you the lolly, like the dummy. She kept the thing that was attached to it. It said something like, kiss me or something like that. I don't know why that was just the best part. What? And he bought me stuff. <laughs> uh, what's the worst memory of the other person? I don't, I don't think breakups count as this one. Because right, because there's a few of them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrified. Um, ow! Uh, it's something that I don't like thinking about. No. It was when we were living in that place. Yeah. You came back like all upset. I'm not going to say why you were upset or anything like that. But... It was the most upset I'd seen you. Yeah. Oh, you know, you know me. I hate seeing you upset. See, he's been nice and being all. Oh, I'm gonna be an absolute. No, that, that is actually my worst memory. Don't get me wrong. We've had some bad times. I'm making my cheekbones. <laughs> yeah, go on. What's yours? Sucking. Do that. Thank you. Thank fuck you said that though. Yeah. 
Because you just, I went, what's the worst memory you had of me? Sucking. Right. He went out. He knows all my telltales of when I'm angry. But he was out with a certain friend. He was supposed to be back by midnight. And then he rang me and said he was supposed to be back by four. And at that point, he was like, ringing me up going, I love you. And I was like, all right, what's he after? So I, I decided to ask him and he was like, I want to go to a certain club. I was like, but you said you'd be back twice. And uh, he was like, but, and I went, it's okay, it doesn't matter. And then he tried again, so I went, no, it's fine. <laughs> and then I went, no, we'll talk about this later. Now, anyone who knows me, and I bet a lot of them have been watching this will understand, he fucked up. Because I was up all night with him, and he came home, and he fell over, and he expected hugs, and I used to say he got an argument. I don't remember the ringing the first time. But did, did, did. did you ever get the other to be the person talking to anyone? Yes. But I need to say something like, yeah. I don't get jealous. I get protective. <laughs> I am still protective of him as my best friend. He's not a lot he's a lot of friends, but he's not allowed to love him as much as he loves me. <laughs> he's only allowed to be my friend and he's only allowed to talk to me and it's same then. <laughs> all my attention. And no, I know what you're all thinking. You're controlling. No, he was allowed to go out. He just had to ring me and make sure he was safe and he wasn't in <laughs> someone else's bed. Because that's stab a bitch. Uh, well, it's no secret, you're friends with a lot of your exes. Not just my exes, they're all boys, all my friends. Yeah, but for me it was more like, I, I did get jealous. But it, it's not like I ever stopped you because I knew like they were only friends, but there's always that part of you that goes, but what if? Let's do eyebrows. How did we both meet? When we first met, uh, I was just coming out of gym. Yeah, yes, of course. I used the gym. I, why is it lying to us? It's the fucking lying to us. I'd just been gym with my mate. We were going over to see another mate who worked across the road from gym. Turns out Sophie was mates with the same mate. So she was she was down seeing him. Funny part of the story, I wasn't the one trying it on with Sophie. No, I'm <laughs> It was my mate that I'd went gym with. You won't leave me alone. I swear down, I love the guy because he, he always, always flirts with anyone. He still flirts with <laughs> He still flirts with everyone, it is brilliant. He'd been trying to flirt, you could tell on Sophie's face, she was just like, the fuck even is this man? Uh, after that, we did meet again, like, obviously. But it was a year or two later. What's the other person's three favourite TV shows? Supernatural, Flash, Arrow. Perfect. What's mine? Yours, American Gods. I think that's the name of it. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> is it called American Gods? I need to know. It is. I'm trying to be gentle. I watch a lot. Of Criminal movies. Minds. Mm -hmm. And I kind of want to say supernatural, but I don't think it is. No, it is, but it's a, it's them and Team Wolf. Oh, well, it's a cross. I can't help it. You come in towards my eye with something. <laughs> You've got big nipples. <laughs> Sorry, you should see the bits. <laughs> I, ju I just looked into camera without moving my head. <laughs> this is going to be a long video. Does that help? It's all slidey. Oh, I've got stuff on my face, that's why. <laughs> Is there anything that we wished we did together? We didn't. Only to one holiday with him. But that's just because I'm holding him to pay money. No. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying. Uh, yeah, no, I want to go on holiday with him. Oh my god, you're out Oh, one minute. Oh, oh, that stings like fuck. Oh, why is that sting? <laughs> it's because it's good in your eye. Yeah, basically it's the same thing, except I wanted it not just to be a holiday, but like a little getaway, yeah. like a little cottage or something. It's Even though I don't look like a cottage person. Your I'm a commoner. Show your eyes. Oh, God. <laughs> Next is the eyeliner. 
See you oh, now. shit in hell. <laughs> Eyeliner. They, they, this is the dead. I thought that was the deadly one. Did you ever lie to protect the other's feelings? I mean, can we just say yes or no? Because mm, this is the one way. Do you remember? I said, yeah, you know. It's not the first time I've done his makeup. Yes. When? Uh, I, th I think you're right, we shouldn't go into it. No. Do I blink now? Yeah, go. Don't blink fully. I said do I blink now and you went, yeah. And then I closed my eyes hey. and then you go, don't blink fully. Hi, I've lied. He, <laughs> he bought a very, very ugly t-shirt. I won't tell him which one he likes it. He bought a very, 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 very ugly t-shirt. And I told him to look lovely in it. Because, you know, it's just, um, what you're going to do. But they won't make you food. So it's my shadow. Yeah, if you want. What's the worst habit of the other person? Your worst habit? It, well, it, it's a simple one. and it's People are going to say that I'm copping out here, but it is your worst habit. Biting your nails. Because you're not, you're not simple. You don't just bite down to the nub. You try biting further. Now go on, what's my worst habit? Which one? <laughs> my worst. You're not putting the toilet seat down. That, that's just many. No, 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 but I'm saying that it's his worst because even now, and it's my house, you know, a woman's house, he still leaves the toilet seat down. What's the thing is he, he um, you can know when he's done it because all I have to say is his name. What is your biggest regret of our relationship? Getting with you. Um, Funny twat. Not walking away from arguments. I'm a sick individual, so if I see him getting one up, I'll prob the bear a bit more and a bit more until he ends up. You know, I love winding him up and I wish I'd just walked away instead of just arguing. Uh, being whipped. You weren't whipped. You weren't I didn't, I didn't stand up for myself you at all. Slave. I literally did everything you asked. Even when I didn't want to, I still said yeah. In cases where I should have said no. Do you feel we were better as friends or in a relationship? No comparison. I'm sorry, we can't. Because in a relationship, he's a really, really good boyfriend. Uh, I was going, when we were together, it wasn't the best time for both of us. Mm. We were both going through hell. I was going through my own problems. He was going. So he was still my best friend because. He had, he had to do things and tell me things that he, sh he, he, he needed. Mm. Who's lost? Um, but now, as my best friend, I couldn't see myself not having him around because he's my best friend. So I can't answer that question because he he was a very good boyfriend. He was a very good best friend. Wow, you've been on even lips. I love, uh, I love the, our relationship, yeah. like every moment of it, but I do think we're better as friends. How have you broken already? How have I broken? As friends, uh, I don't know, I feel more relaxed than that, like, I don't, I don't worry about like having to tell you where I'm going or anything yeah. like that. I mean, I don't didn't feel like I had to back of it. Like you didn't make it's an me. obligation, or you kind of feel like you have to. Yeah, I can say everything to you know, like I can give you shit without. Oh, we have so like, much banter. Do your parents actually like me? My mum said you were a very polite mum. That's good. My dad. That's good. He's a daughter, and no one's good enough for his daughter. So there's the answer. You can take from that what you want. But uh, no, he does not like you. <laughs> he doesn't dislike you, he just does not like you. Uh, well, my mum like, likes you more than she doesn't like you, if you get me. She doesn't like that I hurt her a little bit. There's that. Right, I, I, but I was, she got mad at me for this as well. She didn't like the fact that I was doing everything. Yeah. So she had a go at me about that, but she didn't like the fact that you were letting me do everything. Oh, I did do stuff, it's just he did it most of it because he chose to do it. <laughs> well, hardest part about being friends and exes. After we broke up, we were both at separate 
the full levels. Mm. And I was ready to get into another relationship, which um, is hard because for a best friend, you're supposed to be able to uh, tell them everything, you know, everything. You can't do that with your ex's best friend. I mean, I understand it, but it gets a bit lonely sometimes. Because mm. you can. But uh, it's learning the boundaries that come with being best yeah. friends with your ex. So, there. Uh, For me, it's not screaming at people who turn around and go, how can you be friends with your ex? The first couple of times it was fine because it's like, yeah, people don't understand it. But the problem is you get, you just get tired of it, explaining it and it's like, well, I shouldn't have to explain why I'm friends well, why, with someone. Why are you telling me my bit? Why do I have to explain? Tell me something you never told me while we were together. I preferred spending time with your brother as in like, social, no, socially. <laughs> no, socially, like as in like doing stuff like mm. PlayStation than with you. But I preferred spending time with you when it comes to the relationship -y stuff. I eat fences. There's literally no, oh. I just said something random because I, I, I told you everything. He did. He did it in a very nice way, unlike me, where I'm like, yeah. What first attracted you to me? Oh, your tattoos. Tattoos. Oh, and that. Tattoos. <laughs> tattoos, and not something that I was born with, just something that I got done. Legs. Oh, yeah. I've got really, really, really long legs. Like, five foot eleven, I think. Mm. And it's not that he's a perv, it's that when we first met, I was wearing some shorts because it was summer. So it's not like he was going, ooh, it's <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> what is this? And like, so he's <laughs> his lips. He looks like he's got tiny lips. The worst part is, like, I, since I've not got her, it kind of makes it worse. Um, have you ever watched American Horror Story? Yeah, you look like the. <laughs> Well, I hope you like the video more than I have now. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, thank you for joining me and it's thank you for fucking up my face. Oh, no, it's beautiful. <laughs> well, she's done a good job, even though I, like, I, I look. You look like scary. a girl. It's not ruined anything. We're still best friends. Yeah. Um, don't think that's ever going to change. But uh, this is Sophie and Brain the Scary Lion and. Catch you guys on the next one.